council bosses tonight over controversial plans to scrap a free school bus service to save money. Cardinal Newman is Luton's only Catholic school, and parents say if the free transport is cut, they'll have to rethink where their children study. Anna Todd has just sent this report. Well, very angry scenes here tonight, but also very well informed. The parents have really done their homework and in some areas seem to know more than the council representatives sitting up on the stage. The one thing the parents are concerned about is they're being discriminated against. They say if the free school bus service is cut, then many parents won't be able to afford the faith school option. This is a school of choice. To allow that choice to continue, then it is a cost on the, on the uh, local authority. If they don't pay that cost, then at the end of the day they're withdrawing choice from parents who want a faith choice for their, for their children. I'm just astounded that there was, I don't think there was one question that they actually answered. We know their facts and figures better than they do. And rightly so, because we've looked into this. We haven't come in unprepared. We've, we've spent many a night burning the midnight oil and looking and tearing their shed, um, spreadsheets apart. But the council needs to save millions of pounds over the next few years, and this is just one cost-cutting option. The leader of the council says she will be meeting with parents over the next week, and she also says they may put back the decision-making day, which was set for a week on Monday. It is a real crisis in local government. And um, obviously people don't want to hear that story. I understand, totally understand that. Um, but you have to stand up and tell them that that's the situation the council's in. And it is difficult. It's their children and it's, you know, there aren't easy answers to the bus, the bus issue that they've raised. There were cheers from the audience as one parent said they would take this fight to Parliament. It seems Luton Borough Council has started a battle with a community that won't back down. Anna Todd reporting. If free school transport is being affected where you live, we'd like to hear from you. You can email look.east at bbc.co.uk.